welcome back to more Assassin's Creed Syndicate. Let's move along. I keep forgetting that they automatically go into cover. I'm on my way, Sir David. Throws will take. Quick throws won't be the headshot that I want to get, though. Is there some kind of treasure in here I should be working on? I guess so. Damn. She pulled an AC, uh. An AC4. He's an inventor. He made that tube, the one you stick in your eye. I know what he's doing with those patients. Something's wrong. Oh. <gasps> Nicely done. Nicely done. I like that. Yeah, I know the game just started and I can't really judge it too much, but... So far, I like what's going on with this. Interesting. Yeah. Follow me down the tracks. You stay here and keep a lookout. All right. I'll shout if I get any bother. First for a bird's eye view. Can't be too careful. How will it come apart? Not your concern. Bring back the cargo. So far, so good. Nice. I need two more weeks with the device. Your questionable practices are beginning to draw unwanted attention. You have been given more than enough time to achieve results, Sir David. I was unaware that you expected me to perform like a cocker spaniel. Permit me to remind you of your obligation to the Order. Miss Thorne, you ride me like a racehorse. Sir David. I will return tomorrow. 
If you have not unlocked the device's secrets, forget your dogs and horses. I will leave you to the wolves. Good day. I was merely promised a tour of the premises, my lords. Who sent you? One of green spies. Get that man to interrogation. Then I want him brought to the lab. What a pity. But no deviations from the mission. Assassins are stronger when infiltrating dangerous areas from high places. Yeah, like that actually works. I forgot I could do that. I keep trying to go in the cover like that, damn it. You better not turn around. Keep taking the high ground. Oh, yes, Sir David is a man in Parliament. Oh. Works for me. I don't think anybody heard that either. Why are you going that way? I want you to go this way. Thank you. Now drop down, please, please, please. Why does it take six million button presses to drop down? But she always turns a blind eye when I come home with the earnings. You can bet your last shilling. Confess! My sharp friend here will have his way. Okay. That was a bit weird, but I'll roll with it. Ah, thank you kindly. I was in ever such a squeaky fix when, what do you know? You rescue me. Where's the hidden laboratory? Untie me and then we can parlay, my lady. I'm pressed for time. Tell me now. It's underground. Requires a key. One of the guards nicked mine, cheeky sod. Thank you. Uh, now, untie me? You got yourself in? I trust you can get yourself out again. Not to worry, my lady. Can still recall a couple of tricks from me carnival days. Charming. <laughs> Throwing knives it is. Shit. 
through. Now I gotta figure out how to get over that shit. Just downstairs then. I want to see that artifact. Not if you value your life. That works. Got it. Why am I still getting caught on things? Doesn't make any sense to me. Jesus, man. I was hoping, you know, she would climb the trees. But no. I thought I was in, I guess not. Great, now they can see when I'm on top of things. That sucks. While I'm here, I might as well check this guy for any loot. Should you? Oh. So, so far, it's an interesting game. I'll say that much. Jesus. And where is the secret entrance they speak of? I'm not seeing one. Whoa. Secret agent, secret entrance, secret entrance, secret entrance, secret entrance. There you Se are. The entrance to Bruce's lab. Where? That's not a secret entrance. That's 
like right in front of my face. What kind of bullshit? Danger, men working overhead. Interesting. Back on track. I earned two skill points. XP, earn XP from unlocking perks. So what am I trying to get? Double assassination? Is this an EV only thing? Let's go with that too. It takes too long for them for it to go in a double assassination. No, it can't. So do as you bloody told. And bot the bloke right now. Nice. She's gone scanner brain. This place is full. Oh shit. Yeah, it takes too long to get the double kill going. But I think I just missed money. And that can't happen. I'll take this. So yeah, so far I, I dig it. I really do. I don't know if I if I think it's, you know, one of the better ones or not, but you know, it's off to a good start. It's got some flaws right off the bat, but every one of these games does. Wait, wait. Say what now? What's the prompt? Oh, it's just right trigger to swing. See, that's what I'm talking about. Like, the momentum is really weird because I'm so used to Unity, where you had to like shift between free run up and free run down, and there was no, you know, just free run forward anymore. So now they've kind of incorporated that back in, and it's like. Oh, oh no. Piece of Eden. Increase the electricity. Don't do that. But it'll become unstable, sir. You heard what Miss Thorne said. We need results now. <laughs> it's a wrap for you, Doctor Boy. Transparent. That cheek of that woman. I say I ought to seize the blasted artifact for Edinburgh. Got him. Now let's loot him real quick. He might have some good stuff. Probably a bad idea to just jump right up here. The Templar's grip on London will be fixed. The assassins will fall, and Darwin will be little more than a mere in memory. That is something. 
No! Jesus Christ, I was just trying to climb up the thing. Looks like I'm gonna have to come back around. Second time I've bought the assassination. Second time I've bought the assassination because the game told me to do something that I wasn't supposed to do. Look at that, man! Why was it prompting me to free run down if that's not what I was supposed to do? What the fuck is this? Ugh. I just have to wait. Got him. It is time to lay down your head, Sir David Brewster. But I have so much more to discover. Do not be afraid. I'm not. God will protect me. I will continue your experiment. You will not stop, Staric. Miss Thorne has already found another piece of Eden, more powerful than the last. I will take that one too. Will we fight to gain what we cannot take with us? It's in our nature. Peace. Grab the peace and go. I have to get out of it now. Probably should have grabbed the peace, but whatever. Or not. Come on, please. Go, 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 go. Woo. Jesus. You gotta hurry up for the electricity, get you. Far too close. I must find a way out. I mean, like this hole right here? So you can just squeeze right through? Oh, wow. They're really going for a lot more set-piece moments with that, I can see that. Come on. Look, this game has a lot more cinematic... ...you know... ...moments than... I don't, I don't think I've seen something this... This cinematic since like the the shit like I take that back. It's just it didn't really dawn explosion? on me like this what is explosion? a lot more. There's Easy. a lot more of it in this game so far than this there has been in any of the other games. With it. The magic lump of hyperbolic metal. I'm shocked. Simply because you have never valued the pieces does not all mean went according to plan. Hmm? <clears throat> There was a slight complication. How slight? The lab exploded. Jacob. <laughs> you derailed a train. Oh, he did. Did he? Well, the train derailed and I happened to be on it. I killed my target. Brewster is also no more. Then all in all a successful mission in spite of you two. What about London? What about it? We're wasting our time out here. You know as well as I do that London has been the domain of the Templars for the last hundred years. 
They are far too strong yet. Patience. But the Templars have found a new piece of Eden. Sir David is dead. They do not know how to use it. The Council shall guide us. Sound advice that your father would have seconded. I shall see you back in Crawley. Patience, Evie. Ah, the gentle sound of opportunity passing us by. So what's stopping us? London is waiting to be liberated. Forget Crawley. Father would have wanted us to listen. Oh, Father, you could continue his legacy in London. Freeing future generations from a city ruled by Templars. You know, Jacob Fry, you might just be right. Then shall we? Yes. Let's. Onward to London. You know, that's kind of how you get kicked out of the order. I mean, how many times is somebody gonna just do what they want to do and, and just... The order's like, hey, you can't just do what you want to do. And they're like, but... We want to do what we want to do. And so they get in trouble for doing what they want to do. I just... I, I know, I know. You've only had a taste of our latest acquisition from Abstergo. But I want to check in on Sean and Rebecca. I still think attacking a Templar is a mistake. Call Dr. Grammatica. <sighs> Come on. Who is a pal? What a lovely surprise. Our mutual friends will be here shortly to search for the artifact. Once it's located, I'll let you know. Super. Always a pleasure. Prick. It's people like you that give historians a bad name. I'm afraid I don't have time for you today, Mr. Hastings. Thank you for making my job easy. Oh, shit. What? You guys are like... grim. Master Berg, Agent Acosta, deal with them, please. Move it! Hunt them down! So while, like, I can say that while... What I need to do was wait for you to search the data. Their little stunt has put the whole operation at risk. You need to synchronize Jacob and Evie's memories. Find something that puts us ahead of the enemy. Time is of the essence, and lives are now clearly on the line. Good luck. It's been a long time since I've seen this memory corridor. But while, like, what what I was gonna say is, while the the, the modern s setting, you know, like, it's not. <laughs> Sorry, I was reading that. But while it's not, you know, it's not Desmond. It's actually a lot more interesting than it has been since Assassin's Creed 3, I will say, just based off of, you know, what I'm seeing in this game. We're back to characters that actually matter in the grand scheme of things. So, it's nice to see that they're doing well and still doing assassin stuff. Never seen so many people all at once. <laughs> Churning seas of London. It's just the way Father described. Now, to find Henry Green and formulate a plan of attack against the Templars. Who's Mr. Green again? The assassin watching over London. Did you not listen the first three times? Listen to what? <laughs> <gasps> Oi, watch it. Ben pardon, sir. Oi! Come back here, you filthy dipper! <laughs> I'm gonna put him down. Come here. You gonna give me my shit back? That's what's gonna happen. Get back here, man. This kid is gone. Who 
Look at him! Move. Fine, you little mobsman. Keep it. Well, well. What do we have here? You're on our property. So I guess in order to combo kill people. Excellent. What else does London have to offer? Now is not the time for tourism, Jacob. Now's the time to find Henry Green. I've always been the quicker climber, haven't I? Not since we were two. Race it to the highest vantage point. You're going to lose again. Not on my watch. Take this lift here. Yeep! I beat her. Where is Mr. Green's shop located? It was marked on Father's map. Two assassins. Equal in height. One female. One male. Two decades old. And those devilish smiles. You must be the Fry Twins. And you are? Henry Green, at your service. I was sorry to learn about your father's passing. Thank you. What can you tell us about Crawford Starrick? I suppose the Council desires news. London must be freed, to provide a better future for all of its citizens. Well, thank goodness the Council saw reason and sent you to aid us. Yes. Thank goodness. Unfortunately, I am the bearer of bad news. <laughs> oh my god, they are gonna get Starik in so much trouble. Sits at the helm of the most sophisticated Templar infrastructure known in the Western world. Every class, every borough, the gangs, the industries. His reach extends all across London. I've always thought of myself as a gang leader. Firm, but fair. Huh. Well, I have uniforms. And I'll unite a mix of disenfranchised outsiders under one name. That's it, Evie. We can rally them to our side. Oh, like the way that you rallied those car players at the Oakwood Tavern into the river. Oh, that was different. They beat me at whist. I can see it now. We'll call ourselves the Rooks. You were never good at chess either. Have you got a better plan? Find the piece of Eden. Oh, well, let me show you the lay of the land. Shall we? Synchronize at the vantage point. Let's do it. It takes them a minute to like figure out which action I'm trying Starek to do. Done to the city. If I climb on something like White a pipe, Temple it's really is weird. Riddled with crime, child labor, despite regulations. A gang known as the Blighters overruns the streets, and Templars manipulating behind the scenes. As in all the other boroughs, we need to return this city to the people who built it in the first place. We will free London from Starek. You have my word. And my looks. Miss Fry, your passion is inspiring. Come. Let us return to my shop and I can bring you up to date on the rest. Dude! Oh, I thought he jumped on it. Like, the, the, the bar blended in for, with the building for a minute, so I was like, yo. Jesus. Keep quiet. 
Kalok's looking for me. Who's Kalok? One of Starik's gang leaders. Why does he want you? He's after some of my more arcane research into one of the precursor artifacts. The Peace of Eden. So tell me about these blighters. In search of an army, Starik gathered up the nastiest of the underworld. Some of the city's gangs tried to prevent it and were slaughtered for their efforts. Now, only Whitechapel's clinkers remain opposed, but they're no match for the blighters. Well, let's shine these clinkers up then, shall we? They're just the sort we're looking for. You can't be serious. Evie, they're ready to fight and oppose the blighters. This is my chance to step in. Look out, London. Here come the rooks. You really need a better name than the rooks, sir. Just gonna let you know that right now. this city no one looks where they're going yes I've noticed that bloody drood I'll never finish it at this rate only Providence knows where those words are headed now well I must get to work replacing them should you ever be in the mood for a tale or two you can always find me where the ale is warm and tempers are hot ta-ta what an odd man that mr. Fry was Charles Dickens knows everyone and everything in the city. If I were you, I would keep that connection in your back pocket. <clears throat> Kaylock's gang is nearby. They must not follow me back to my shop. We'll take care of it. Yeah. You might be able to use this. Oh, God, I hope so. My carriage is nearby. Make use of it to throw them off my trail. I will meet you at the curio shop. Are you saying, what is this GTA? Here comes trouble. The characters are easily damaged. Uh, 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 this reminds me of like sleeping dogs. Now to return to Mr. Green. Aye, aye, Captain. You're relentless. That relentlessness will see me become master when we finish this. George would do nothing of the sort. Whatever's left of the creed would perish under your control. Harsh words, dear sister. Are we drive to the left? I do hope Mr. Green made it back safely. You don't tell me you fancy the bloke already. And what do you suggest we do if our number one source of information turns up dead? Starry can't be that hard to find. I say we turn the carriage round and go find him. This is why you aren't in charge. How do I get out of this damn thing? <laughs> Ow! She pushed me! What a bitch! Did you give them the slip? We gave them more than that. <laughs> Who are all these people? Over the years, I have established a number of connections across the city. Splendid. We'll need focused aid. Focused aid? <sighs> we take over Starek's gangs, we cripple his control. You're not aiming high enough. Starek has influence in every branch of society. We need to match him. I see what you're saying, Evie. We need the Rooks. You are not starting a gang called the Rooks. I believe I may have an idea of my own. We will need the police to turn a blind eye to our activities. My ally in the force, Sergeant Abilene. I've heard he's a master of disguise. Next up, urchins. 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 Children make for excellent spies. Clara O'Day. Smart as a whip, that one. Finally, you would be wise to remember that Starek never acts alone. There are gang leaders in every borough. You'll meet them soon enough, no doubt. Rexford Gaylock. Known for his ability to vanish before your very eyes. Should we make him vanish for real? I suppose. One moment. Um, a Templar target you might want to look into. Uh, be cautious. It's rough out there. No, don't worry about me, Greeny. I can handle a few thugs. I'm giving this one a five. The London map.
What's the plan then, oh mighty planner? You're the one with the grand ideas. The gangs, the fights, even the outfits you'll wear. Perhaps you should lead the way. If you insist. Switch characters. How do I switch characters? Oh shit. Lawyer, I know cat when I taste it. Over there! Stay where you are! Please! Running! Obviously, I cannot take on this dude. Even though he's like level two, that's what I'm talking about. That's exactly what I was worried about. That right there. Dude's literally like level two, and I still can't do anything against him. It's so stupid. Anyway, thank you for watching. Remember to leave a like if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you want to see more. Share this video around. Share it with your friends. Share it with other YouTubers, guys. I don't care. Do what you can do to help me out. I'll catch you in the next part later on.